doing?
Those are guys that are lukewarm, man. You know, and if you spread a lot, they just concentrate on that thing. And of course, we had to hire a man bomber to call. I'm going to bring on the article out on that as well. World War III update. But, you know, both sides of the search and tools that we can use. Okay? Now, so, yeah, I was trying to say this from chapter 12, verse 27. Luke 12, 45. But, and if that servant say in his heart, my Lord delayeth his coming, as a man that settled on his knees. Alright? And shall begin to beat the men servants and maidens, and to eat and drink, and to be drunken. So you see that a lot. Okay? Certain guys fall out, and they start becoming what? Scoffers. Okay? They become an enemy of the cross. They become an adversary of Yahweh Shai by scoffing at his men. Okay? And they say that what? Let me read that again. And shall begin to beat the men servants and maidens, and to eat and drink and be drunken. Stop following the philosophies of, of this world. The ways of this world. They go back to their promise. Okay? They're drunk or womanizer or adulterer. They go, they go back to that. And then some seven demons. They were homosexuals, and they go back to that. Man. They're liars, thieves, covetous. They go back to that. And then they start scoffing and mocking. See? It says, The Lord of that servant will come in a day when he looketh not for him, an hour when he's not aware, and will cut him in sunder, and will point him his portion with the unbelievers, man. Which, what's going to happen to those that have made not the gospel? I'm going to get that precept in a minute. Alright? It says, And the servant which knew his Lord's will, and prepared not himself, not in accordance to his will, shall be beaten in any stripes. You are going to catch the most hell. Because the most high opened up his secrets to him. You actually tasted the kingdom and the power of the most
don't go that way, man. That's that. He's supposed to be washed from that. All right, it says, but now much more my actions work out your own salvation with fear and trembling. Fear, man. Okay? You have to fear your how about shimmy out shot. That's what the Heavenly Father is looking for. That's what's not being taught in these churches. <laughs> right? Frightened, you're supposed to be afraid of the heavenly father. That's what Yahweh Shai said. Let me get Matthew 10 28. Matthew chapter 10. Verse 28. fear him which is able to destroy both soul and body in hell. Alright? Which that's not talking about a physical face in hell. It's talking about destruction. Man. The Lord can torment you in your flesh. Man. You see? There ain't no uh, um, imaginary mythological place in the ground where you burn forever. And Satan is going to be waiting for you. That's not in the Bible. Man. Okay? The word there for hell when you look it up in the New Testament. It's Gehenna, which is a physical place in Jerusalem where they burn bodies in trash. And in the Old Testament, the word there is Sheol, which means the grave. They shall declare it. It says, Because it shall be revealed by fire, 
which is what he was trying to say. Let me go back.
1 Corinthians chapter 3. So we link that to the part about baptism. Jump back to 1 Corinthians chapter 3, verse 13. Every man's work shall be made manifest, and they shall be done. Even know what you're asking for, man. Are you able to drink the cup that I'm about to drink? Right? What's that cup before I continue? Mark 75. Psalm 75, verse 7, it says, but the Most High is the judge. No, verse 8. For in the hand of Yahweh shall shine. 
there is a cup and the wine is red. It is full of mixture, and he poured out of the same. But the dregs thereof, all the wicked of the earth, shall wring them out and drink them. So Yahweh Shai actually drunk that cup, man. He took on every sin of the nation, man. The sacrificial lamb. He was the scapegoat. Okay? He died the worst death ever, man. And the scripture says that please him on side to bruise his son. But that shows you what kind of man the Heavenly Father is, man. So if he did it to him, he's going to do it to you.